Emily was in a school not too far from here called Baylor University, where she was um, a student, a Baylor Bear. And, um, and so I was thinking about how, you know, all of a sudden these, um, these thoughts about how quickly that little season of life passed by. And literally, like they say, the cliche is true. You blink your eyes and it's over. And I'm thinking, I don't get to tuck Emily in anymore. And I used to love tucking her in and telling her stories and making up these goofy stories. And, you know, bath time is definitely out of the question now, forever, with her. I won't, you know, that's no more. And so I'm thinking, I don't get to, you know, I won't, I won't get to do that for very much longer with my youngest daughters. And so I started to, you know, feel very guilty about having blown a very wonderful moment that God gave me with them. And so I wrote a song. And, um, and it was a song really just to remind me to stop and savor the moments that I have. And it's the song, because of the title, it immediately became the favorite of, show, of Stevie Joy and Maria and Shelly. And it's called Cinderella. And it's, you know, anything to do with Cinderella, of course, they're gonna love it. And um, so they love the song. And you can understand why, um, as special as that song was to us, it immediately, on May the 21st of 2008, it became a very different song. And I didn't know if I would ever sing it again, because I thought, you know, how am I going to sing a song about, you know, the clock striking midnight and, and me not being able to dance, not getting to dance with my Cinderella's anymore, and now Maria is in heaven. And, and at first, like I said, I didn't know if I'd sing it, but the song has actually become something very different for me now. And it's a lot because of something that a dear friend of mine said to me. And interestingly enough, his name was Greg Laurie. He said this to me only about two months before his son was killed in an accident. He says, Stephen, I want to encourage you to remember that because the gospel is true, because everything that, that you've ever sung about is true, and everything we're here tonight celebrating is really true. It's not a fairy tale, but it is true. Then the promise of God is that your future with your daughter Maria is so far greater than your few short years of your past. You have an infinitely long, perfectly long future with her. And that is the hope that we have. And I, I realized that one night as I was trying to decide, can I ever sing this song again? And I thought, you know what? I gotta keep singing this song. Now, because yes, I know that there is a very short, we don't know how short our time is together. And, and let's not miss the moments that God's given us this side of heaven because those are special, sacred moments He's given us with each other. But we can do that because of the hope that is coming, because we know there's a day coming when He will wipe every tear from our eyes, and He will make everything new. And because of that hope, because of that reality, we can live these moments, these moments that are hard, these moments that are sometimes so almost unbearably hard, these moments that are that are filled with mystery and, and confusion and question, we can say, God, but, but that day is coming. So help me to remember that day into this moment, in, into the right now, right here. So I'm still singing this song for that reason. And um, so uh, if it's all right with you, um, I would like to sing this song again um, tonight. This is song. And she sways to whatever song plays without a care in the world. And I'm sitting here wearing the weight of the world on my, my shoulders. It's been a long day and there's still work to do. She's pulling at me saying, Dad, I need you. There's a ball at the castle. I've been invited and I need to practice my dancing Oh please, Daddy please So I dance with Cinderella while she's here in my arms Cause I know something the prince never knew Too soon, 
She came home today with a ring on her hand Just glowing and telling us all they had planned She says, Dad, the wedding is six months away And I need to practice my dancing Oh, please, Dad, please So I Dance will go on